what we're looking at here is a valve operating system specifically designed to control isolation valves on high pressure natural gas pipelines. Now, for more than 50 years, the most efficient and reliable method for powering these type of actuators has been to use the high pressure gas in the pipeline. The only drawback to gas powered actuators is that gas is exhausted to atmosphere after each stroke of a valve. Gas pipeline operating companies have come under intense pressure to reduce methane emissions. Our new emissions controlled actuator technology, or ECAT as we call it, helps address the need to reduce methane emissions. This new technology provides our customers with all the advantages of conventional gas powered actuators. However, there is zero emissions associated with this product. What you're seeing in this video is pipeline gas pressurizing hydraulic fluid. The gas is light blue, the fluid is red. The high pressure hydraulic fluid is utilized to stroke the actuator, which is the blue component in the center. The actuator muscle is the reliable Schaefer rotary vane, which is backed by a 10 year warranty. When the stroke's complete, a small electrohydraulic power pack automatically turns on and re-injects the gas back into the pipeline. Once the gas is pushed back into the pipeline, the power pack will automatically kick off. The fact that the motor only runs during the re-injection process is a key feature to the technology. Exactly though how this is accomplished is a lesson for another time. With the motor off, the actuator is now in the ready to stroke state, once again ready to be powered by pipeline gas pressure. Thank you.